Good afternoon, everyone. It's Saturday. Look at this beautiful blue bird sky. Oh, man. Beautiful, gorgeous day. It's warmed up. It's in the 50s. Temps are back to the normal around here. I'm out and about today. Been kind of feeling crafty. Earlier in one of my videos, kind of shared about the blindness that we struggle with. And uh, that's a very real thing for, I truly believe, everyone who is alive. But today, it's sunny, it's beautiful. We've got some smoke and essence going on right there. Maybe I'll share that with you in a little while. I'm going to build me a little chair. Built me a table the other day. And a week or so back, I built a small bench. And now I'm going to try to build a, a small chair. So we'll see how that goes. All right, I had to come down to my shelter to get some scrap wood. But I'm going to use on this project. So I'm going to have to carry this back up to my work area. All right, the bearded Bama bushcrafter turns 50 in just a couple of weeks. And I'm going to do another giveaway. And due to the fact that I'm turning 50, man, that sounds wild, 50, half a century, I'm going to do the giveaway when I reach 150 subscribers. And a lot of y'all probably saying, dude, you just gave away something at 120. Well, we've got something else to give away. Y'all stand by. Some of y'all have already seen this in my giveaway video that I did um, last week with the Camelus Titanium Fixed Blade. I showed this little tool off. And this is just a little bush tool, brush tool. I don't really know who's by. I don't have the unopened packaged with me. It's got a little bill hook on it learned that this was real popular with arborists and foresters you can do some chopping down cleaning limbs off and things of that nature it has a saw on it I like the grip the grips nice these little holes here I was curious so we we found out that when you use this for a draw knife this is actually something to kind of help you have a little grip in the palm of your hand or if you're Left-handed, right-handed, whatever. It's pretty sharp. Nice little tool to throw in your kit. I'm going to give this away at 150. When I reach 150 subscribers. The sheath with this thing, it's nylon. It's got a zipper on it. And I've learned that this snap is almost makes it childproof. Not real thrilled with the scabbard or sheath. Nowhere for you to put your belt. And this is supposed to be... Uh, for your shoulder for a small person like my son who he now owns this at least that's what he told me it fits him perfectly but if uh this is going to a child adults make sure you supervise them um you're gonna have to be 16 years or older to win this and there'll be more on the giveaway as we go along so anyway thought i'd share that with you Looking for my dog, Darby. There he is. Come here, Darby. What's up, buddy? That's a crazy little mutt right there. He is mixed with two of the greatest breeds a person could have. Cocker Spaniel and Schnauzer. I'm going to tell you what, he is a mouthy dog, but he's a good dog. He has a funny little thing he likes to do when he's outside. He likes to hunker down on the ground when he thinks you're not watching and a lot of and i'm gonna tell you sometimes he'll get you and you'll get a certain distance from him and he'll charge at you growling and he he scared me earlier <laughs> wasn't paying attention and he out of my corner of my eyes here he comes it's a funny little thing he likes to do real quick why while i'm thinking about it I wanted to show the little table that I made the other day. And uh, 
fits nicely here in the shelter. Just all scrap wood. Screwed it together. Um, my little stove fits right on it. Got my lantern. Boom. Sturdy. Sturdy, sturdy. I'm going to make a chair. We're going to see how the chair turns out. And then uh, who knows what we'll get into today. It's funny. This past week I've been feeling crafty, I guess. Also, I want to say I really appreciate everyone who is following along on the Bearded Bama Bushcrafter channel. Um, had some of my friends encourage me to, you need to do a YouTube channel. Some folks even suggesting suggesting that I do a podcast, um, but I'm trying to get this channel going if I'm successful with this thing. Uh, I guess I'm successful now. I've got some followers, people who are who show interest, and, in, you know, that's better than zero, right? All right. <clears throat> I may get attacked here by Darby, what I was talking about a few minutes ago. He's up here on the hill. And he is pretending at the moment that he doesn't see me. Oh, here he comes. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yeah. He's a nut. He got me. I saw him that time. He's so funny. He can scare you. Especially at night. <laughs> You're out here walking around all of a sudden. Rah, out of the shadows comes this. And he runs right up to you. Little comic. Man, the smoker is going. I've got some tasty yumminess going on it. I'm gonna have some late night supper stuff. Not late night, hopefully not too late. Look at that thing ginning. Alright. Stand by. Fun fact about having children. Don't. No, I'm kidding. That's a joke. Totally kidding. I hope you guys aren't following me along for the most part about safety tips. Whenever you're out here doing stuff like this, you should have goggles. However, I am not able to locate my goggles. So, hmm, I wonder what happened to them. Anyway, like I said, hopefully you're not following me for uh, how to be safe. I throw that out there. You should be wearing safety goggles when you're cutting, sawing. However, I don't know where they are. So, chance I'm taking. All right, rambling on there. Here we go. Not my skill saw, my jigsaw today. This is gonna be my C part. Getting a bit of cuts out of this piece of wood. All right, so I'm gonna. I'm, this is just actually stuff coming out of my head. So who knows how this is gonna turn out? We shall see. Columbus's rock station, Rock 103. If you talk to Trent Reznor about it, he will tell you to this day he's frustrated all, because it's a song that's so misunderstood. Minus it isn't closer. It's A.D. Roundtree, and it's true. Trent Reznor says everybody just thinks it's all about doing it. And he's like, what people don't understand is that it's not about doing it per se. It's about hating yourself. And then Another funny doing thing. it because you're trying to forget that you hate you yourself. Should have Ear protection yeah. on. I've said it before. Don't know where my earmuffs are. Trent Reznor's shrinks. Make sure fingers and everything are out of the way. ZZ Top and Nirvana are next. And you. Are you living the life you want to live, or the one that others want you to? Look, it's gonna make if a nice so, little You're not alone. For the chair. I'm your host. It's gonna just be a small camp chair for the shelter. So. Not worried about it. You know, fitting properly in someone's home. Just kind of something to sit on, sit on while you're down at the shelter or around the fire or something, you know. Like most camps do. I guess this would be a stool more so than a uh, than a proper chair. A little helpful tent. A little, golly, I get so tongue twisted sometimes. Helpful hint. When you're cutting wood, you got to take into my into consideration 
the width of your saw blade. So when you make your measurement, you got to, whatever the width of that blade is, you need to keep that in your figure. So you'll be correct with your measuring when you cut. And always remember, measure twice and cut once. Something my dad shared with me years ago. I used to work with him when I got out of high school and he was a glass glazer. He cut a lot of mirrors and, and glass and whatnot. He always taught me about cleaning the edges, even when you're doing woodworking. Smoothing them down. Looks good. Makes it look better. When I make my birdhouses, I do that. And it really does make a difference. So I take my my disc sander and I run them down the edges and clean them up. And that's a... I'm glad he shared that with me. Because I've kept that in mind as I do things. It really does make for, for a better finished product. I'm just full of helpful hints today. When you're drilling, always drill yourself a pilot hole before you put your screw in. Even if you're nailing stuff. Helps you from splitting the wood. That's what I learned over the years. It's coming along. I'll put a back on it. <laughs> My skills. All right, well, we're almost done with the little stool camp chair. Molly's sitting in it. She's mauling it off for us. Molly, help me. It's 32 in the bank. Not, not wobbly. Now I got to make a back for it. Got an idea for it. Let's see how this works. I believe the chair is finished. Got my new model. Made this little back for it. Pretty sturdy. Not wobbly at all. Now to take it to the shelter and set it up there. Let's see how that looks. You going to the shelter with me? Y'all going down to the shelter? Okay, so Dad is in the chair, and it's that sturdy that Dad is in the chair. <laughs> and there's Silas. Silas doing his happy dance. All right, one more quick thing about the giveaway at 150 subscribers. <laughs> I have the knife that we're going to give away. Watch out, son. I'm pulling this out. Okay, you need to calm down. I'm getting a blade out. I'm going to give away this chopping tool at 150 subscribers when I get there probably gonna do like I did at the uh, 120 see how long it holds I believe I'm at 125 now so I have grown a little bit since the giveaway but at 150 celebrating my 50th anniversary here on this planet we're gonna give away this tool yeah. no I'm kidding <laughs> I really appreciate everyone who's following along if you like my videos hit the like button and um, I don't know why y'all always got to try to slap that phone down and touch it. Lost my train of thought. <laughs> Molly, you do the ending for me. Okay, well, Dad made a nice little chair that Talos is sitting in. Here now. So, if you guys liked these crafting videos, make sure that you like it and subscribe for Silas's ginger ale <laughs> and then oh, and then um go ahead and hit the notification bell to be notified every time he posts a new video and then well that's all and cracking videos are great so you guys better comment down below if you liked it see you guys later hope you all have a blessed day bye bye